Hey guys, I'm gonna show you what I got at the tack room show. Sorry if my phone goes off, I have it on like the sound ringtone thing. So yeah, I'm gonna show you the placings and go pretty fast because I also got a lot of stuff. And sorry if I I just told you that. Wow. Anyway, so I'll start the placings. Um over here I got one participant ribbon in the fun class. My little custom got a participant, which is a, basically the last place. But you really like the coloring on them. The fifth, I got my buttercup here. In the fullest class, got a fifth. Um, my Glossier Form the Thoroughbred class got a fifth. And my Sunny in the Light Breed got a fifth as well. And Argyle got a fifth. He's the only winter song that. No. Never mind. Yeah. She didn't like the winter song because their chestnuts were painted on. I didn't even know they're supposed to have chestnuts. I haven't really noticed. And then this guy was really shocking. Um, he got fifth, which is. I think it was last. You know, I think he placed the bus in stalemate, but I don't know. So weird. And this guy, my little stalemate, is the only one that got a fourth. And then this guy, Chinook, got a third because the judge pointed out that he has a dent in his neck. And basically he's a beginner's custom. And if I get those fixed, he'll be a really good competitive show model. That's Chinook. And this guy was totally last minute. You guys didn't even see me my show's during. This is my little rookie rocker. He's in pretty bad condition. But he got third out of a pretty decent class. My Aurelius got a third. She liked the breed. Oh, she liked the breed on her too. And Secretariat got a third in the quarter class, which is pretty good. For a second, so I'm going really fast. I just need to get over placings. <laughs> in the Mustang, no, other stock breeds. My Hidalgo got a second. And then the paint class, my Montana got a second. Now first, my connoisseur, I think his name was Mascu, no. I forgot what she called him, or what his name is, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, he got a first. My Glossy Gigi got a first. My, what's her name? Uh, Like Thunder got a first. And Carrot got a first. She does not like the Carrot mold, but she really liked um, the breed I put for him, which is a paint horse. So, those are the these placings. Alright, now for the fun classes, which is for performance, basically. And instead of normal ribbons, they handed out these nice rosettes. So, in performance, um, in the western class, my Harley D Zip here got a second place with this tack that I made. Hold on. With this saddle, um, this saddle pad, this bridle, oh, let me try to get it, I like stuck, bridle, and this martingale thing, and she said she really liked how everything was color coordinated, she said the only thing I should have added was a throat latch, for safety reasons, um, so yeah, and she liked how everything was color coordinated, I think I already said that, I don't know. I'm tired, guys. I'm sorry. So we gotta go to the races right after the show. But yeah. She said I just need to add a throat latch. And then there's other stalemate performance that was really cute. We got a first, but I got a second and I'm really happy. And there's three horses in that class. Yeah. Now let's move on to the first place ones. Alright. For the English class, which is the first performance class, my strapless was the model. And here's her tack. <clears throat> Here's the saddle. I made it. The boots right here. The martingale. And the bridle. She said she really liked it. She liked the saddle pad. She said the bell boots I can fix. And I was so dumb. I like put her on the table. I didn't adjust anything. The stirrup was like this. And then the bridle, like the bit wasn't in place. I was so stupid. I don't know why. Though. And a tacky wax that says when someone was holding the rain. She said she liked that. But yeah, and she got a first in the English class. And for that first, for that first place, she won me the Chinese Year of the Horse, which um, I don't really like, but I actually kind of like him now. Um, well, I'm free basically. So yeah, she won me him, and my dad actually wants him, so I'm going to give him to my dad. But yeah. Woohoo. So yeah.
Okay, let's move on to the last placing. All right, for the last placing, which is the most exciting, my Hamlet in this showmanship for miniature horses placed first. And here's the tack. Here's a little halter. I messed up right there, so I had to put a ribbon in front of it, but here's the halter. Here's the ribbon. This is actually made by my friend Mariah or Rise Models on Instagram. This is, I had the stuff. And then I made these little poles. And um, I had a rider um, ready to be with him, you know, just to run with him. So I had to put her on his neck because she wouldn't stand, and I asked the judge what I would to do. He said you can either put it on the ground or wrap it around him, and I'm like, okay, just do that. And he also had this little thing here. Um, here is the little arena thing that I had. Oh, God. Uh, these would fall. She said she really liked this. She liked all the extra hoof prints everywhere. And this is so cool. This is kinetic sand. Spot. Um, you guys should really get this stuff. It's so weird. And so we went the Michaels because I did everything last minute because I'm a procrastinator really bad. But we went the Michaels and this is like $5. It's like 50% off. So that was awesome. That was on sale. So that was the little base and she said she really liked it. Um, so yeah, we went a first. And with winning that first place, he won Bear. Green box. Um, I already have her. <laughs> But mine's like in pre bad condition, and I'm gonna show this one. She looks really good. So, yeah. And this is my most exciting placing. Everyone loved this little scene that I did. I also like Chinook a lot. But yeah, there's a photographer. She's doing pictures of my entry and stuff. Awesome. I'm so proud of this little dude. So cute. And she said she really liked it. She said it was really adorable. And it placed out of like six entries, five or six. There's some really good entries. Like there's this one with a with a doll, like a China type doll. And she had like a really pretty dress on and she had Broke Light Magnum like holding him. And he had a really pretty halter. And they had like a pasture scene, like a little parade thing. It was really cute. And I'm so happy he placed. I didn't really think he would do well with all the competition, but he got first and I was so happy with him. So yeah, those are all the placings. I'm gonna show you the model that I got. Okay. So the first thing that I got, they were handing out goodie bags for all the showers, and um, this is what the, I got, and I'll show you what I got. So I got two bar catalogs, I got another one, my mom gave me it. <laughs> but this is like, oops, like the new one for this year. So I got two of those. Got a little Ricky Rocker button. Yep. Um, I have two bar pencils. These are the newer ones, I have the older ones, that's pretty cool. So I have two bar pencils. A big package of paint brushes. These different paints, which like look really old. And nasty so I probably won't be using them and cosmetic sponges or just sponges and this cute little bag and then here's all the brushes like the paintings we didn't do paintings so they just handed these out so I got this quarter horse thoroughbred this he looks kind of blue and her tail kind of looks too close but this is like the dri dri wow driving horse the quarter horse the illusion and the pony I always wanted the pony so cute and um I'm gonna be painting all these um, some of them might be up for commission, I'm not sure, but, yeah. Okay, now I'm going to show you the other things. Okay, so, Emily, or Reading Heart 3, won, like, overall champion and reserve of the breed division. And she didn't want this doll, so she gave it to me from performance entry, but she would not stand. But i actually been wanting her, she's really pretty. I don't really, like, have a briar burn, but I just, like, always want her. She's really pretty though. And then she has her little hat and she's new in box. I just took her out of the box for the performance scene, but she didn't fit. And then this is another small thing. I got this little Stanley Olive Bride, 25% off. It's really cute. He's got the little jumper. So I, why not, you know? And he's really dark and crisp. I handpicked him. So those are those things. Now for the traditionals. Alright, the next traditional I got. This was, I actually bought this one. <laughs> Didn't want him. But this is Totilus, or Totilus, whatever you want to call him. Um, I picked, I had to pick between Zinata and him because I didn't want to get too many horses. So I decided to get him and um, Mariah, or Rise Models, and Beating Heart, or Emily, whatever you want to call them. Said I should get him. But yeah, I'm really happy I got him. I've had him before, and I, if I would have got Zinata, she would have been my third Zinata. <laughs> I painted one, got another one, traded it, and then that would be my third. 
Product, this is my second tea list, and he looks pretty crisp. His box is really damaged, though. But yeah, he's really cute. So that is that guy. Now for the last model that I got. The last model I got, who was like 40% off, she was like $25, something like that. Um, yeah, I got her, and she's the most common, but I don't care. They had all the variations, but whatever. I actually, like, right as we were about to leave, I just saw her, I'm like, okay, whatever, I'm gonna get her. And my mom really likes her, she's happy that I finally got her. But she is gorgeous, and I love her so much. And I can't wait to take these out of the box. So, yeah. Those are the briars I got. And then, of course, the other ones. These little cuties. And then my little goodie bag. And also, I got this bag for purchasing Totus. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. And comment or subscribe. Bye, guys.